guys, welcome. It's me again, Mr. Finanimous. So we're here again for another Xiaomi review. Awesome, right? So I just hope all of you guys are doing great and all of you are safe. So before we proceed, if you find this uh, video helpful, you can give it uh, like a thumbs up and probably subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out any videos that I'm going to post. So today we're going to review uh, this gadget. So it's called the Xiaomi uh, Mija Water Iron Hair Dryer. All right. So I got this from uh, Ch China last year. Also, I visited around August um, and September. So I got this um, for uh, 1,500 pesos. So this particular item is already available in the Philippines, but I don't know how much it costs. I've checked online um, from Shopee and Lazada, it's about 2,500 something. So that's a lot of difference. But I haven't checked the local store, Xiaomi local store here in the Philippines. I think it should be about 1,700, maybe like a 200 peso difference. I, I don't know yet. But yeah, if you know guys, probably could just comment below. It took me a while for me to do like a review on this gadget because to be honest I don't use hair dryer a lot so I only use it um, occasionally <laughs> for special occasions probably if I have to like go to like a wedding Christmas party so if I need to look extra good then <laughs> I blow dry my hair I just wanted to show you the the old hair dryer I'm using from Remington so I got this a long time ago. Um, it served me well, but I think it's quite damaging to my hair. And um, I, I just need an upgrade. And sometimes if I want to bring this with me when, I, when I'm traveling, it's kind of bulky, you know? So I, I, those are the two considerations. Number one, the performance and of course the size because I want it to be very handy. That's why I got this um, Xiaomi hair dryer and uh, yeah, before we proceed with my thoughts about this product and the performance, let's do the unboxing first. Alright, let's go! the unboxing I proceed using this Xiaomi hair dryer so that I can give you my feedback and my review so again I'm just scrutinizing this machine for more than two hours so this is just my initial review for the Xiaomi media water ion hair dryer yeah the name is so long I think that's the only problem I can see <laughs> for this blower but yeah um, so far so good and I'm really liking the product and I'm really happy that I bought it. Yeah, so again um, When you see this blower um, What would really catch your attention is the magnetic nozzle feature. So for me um, That's a deal breaker because that became a problem with my previous blowers because blower gets hot, right? so initially it's not a problem for the nozzles but over time, as you use it, it becomes very brittle. <laughs> and that will become a problem. It breaks easily. But with this, my experience is that because it's magnetic, it's easier to attach it. You can hear the snap because it fits perfectly. And uh, it's very stable. And you can rotate this 360 also. Um, I think the craftsmanship for this is really amazing. So even if you shake it really, really, really hard, you don't have to worry that it will fall off. 
because yeah it fits perfectly guys so i like i like that part and i think the inspiration came from the dyson if you're the dyson blower if you're familiar with that but that would cost you a lot of moolah i really like the magnetic feature deal breaker really so also when it comes to the design simple stuff works for me it's very straightforward it's a blower but it's white but i don't mind but if there's a black color for this one then probably i'll get that instead um yeah and it's in matte finish a plus point for me for a guy with sweaty hands matte finish works because it's not slippery at all um also it's compact you can compare the size from my old blower it's a lot smaller so i can bring this now when i travel probably um and it's very light so if you're holding your blower like this for a long time it's not a problem anymore allow me to walk you through the the buttons it's not a very complicated blower so it comes in two levels level one level two on how soft or hard you want the air to blow and the modes so it comes in three modes guys one is the hot air number two is the hot and cold air yeah <laughs> and number three is cold air yeah you just have to plug it in um this is level one the softer blow and level two yeah yeah so just like your typical blower yeah the sound is still there can they really silence this i don't know but yeah the sound is still there but i don't smell anything actually because in my with my old blowers they have this distinct uh, blower smell that i don't experience here with my xiaomi blower which i think is amazing it comes with a led light for the modes button the circular button here uh, above the levels so when you put this on automatically it's in hot air so the button is color orange so when you want to change this to another mode if you want to change this to hot and cold air then you just have to press it again single press not a long press so now the light is alternating orange and blue because it is now in hot and cold air but if you want a cold air you just have to press it again there I don't know if you can see it now it's color blue indication that it is now in cold air mode that's amazing right so I think the old blower it's everything's hot <laughs> for this blower this is really a power blower so the difference is um, the hot air for this one is less hotter compared to my old blower so i think if you're trying to dry your hair this would take a little more time um, drying your hair because the the, the hotness for this um, xiaomi hair dryer is not that hard compared to the you know the usual blower that we use the par the parlor blowers but yeah sometimes this is good but i prefer the hotness of this blower i think it's mild and it's not damaging to the hair yeah for me again the unique selling proposition for this blower is the water ion which is very interesting here it guys so based on my readings um so when you turn this on you can see the led light there so that's the indication of the water the water ion so the water ion is the built-in condensation needle that condenses and moisturizes the air so that's what it says um, it saves us from damaging our hair in our scalp and it reduces the static electricity so in that way it releases moisture to your hair so the least we wanted for our hair blower is for it to be damaging so we don't want that so yeah i think water ion is the solution for it hey hey guys so far so good i really like this product I, I have a very short hair a thin hair so it doesn't need much of heat for it to dry up again i i don't use hair dryer a lot so i'll stick with this 
um, plus it's cool it's light and it's compact so I like it I hope you find this video helpful if you have any questions I'll try my best to answer you back and give you more information about this machine yeah if you like this video guys please give it a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel I'm saying it for the first time but yeah please subscribe guys and um, I'll see you again on my next video stay tuned and stay safe guys bye